what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? They said, okay, because about time. About time for what? Girl, I want every last drop. Good morning, say it's Messy Monday. Wake up, wake up, girls. I'm no, I had look, so I was a little look, look, look before y'all even go into that. Happy birthday. Yeah, I told you happy birthday on Facebook. So, yes, we are green again. All right, so before we go into anything, you heard me. Welcome to Messy Monday. I'm your host with the most MC Shane ever seen life on. Girl, look, and so don't be telling me something about being late and all that stuff like that. I had to take care of some stuff. Um, there was some issues. I so I woke up late one. That was first. And I woke up late one first. And then I had some stuff to do, girl. And then there was some stuff I had to do uh with my um son healthcare. It was some stuff I had to fill out pay. It was all kind of stuff. And so uh that's why I'm a little a little, just a little, not much. That's why I'm a little, you know, on CP time. You hear me? So before y'all go ahead on and try to go in on me for being a little late and all that stuff like that, excuse me, excuse me. I'm sorry. Okay, I have to take us some business. What's going on? How y'all doing? How, y how is y'all doing? How's y'all doing this messy Monday? How? Girl, hold on. Get this together, girl. Hold on, y'all. Girl, hold on. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> hold on. Okay, so look, the, for, the, for this to go on, um, you, so I got more tea stuff. Hold on, girl. Girl, how can I? <sighs> oh, no, that was a mess up right there. <laughs> My computer is me is not going to mean we're not feeling the same. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, so let's get into what we need to talk about. All right, so as y'all know, every Messy Monday, we are sponsored by somebody. This week's Messy Monday, instead of getting a sponsor, I decided to sponsor it myself. So this Messy Monday is sponsored by The Kingdom. The book is available. I'm going to put the link in my bio. When I find my other phone, I don't know where it's at. So this is it's sponsored by the Kingdom. It's also for those of y'all that is in the Sip Nation Book Club. It is the book of the month. Um, I was supposed to see Shay has more information about it, uh, and she can give you definitely some insight into what's going on uh, with that. So make sure you get your copy. The link will be in my bio when I find my other phone, um, and when I get my computer to act right. I need a new computer like yesterday. Me and this computer is not getting along. All right, so let's see what we got to talk about today. We have some stuff to talk about. We got some more tea to spill. Today is not over. As y'all know, I generally spill some, and then I come. I do not read the bit. I read the girls for different. You know the ones I don't like. Um, no secret. For girls that say, I'm always talking about them. It's not me always talking about them. They only get Mondays. And so it is Mondays. And so this is their day. And so um, let's talk about, because I got some, I really got some tea to spill. I got some tea to spill. Well, it's, it's, it's tea on somebody that I really don't like for real because last week we had some tea tea but this week I got some tea mm. and uh -huh. so I want to spill it but okay I always have something some kind of like a little mission or something we gotta do whoever was in Dallas about to buy something from Sue Cosmetics I don't know why you didn't buy nothing but girl we need to talk about that and the reason I know that because I was gonna talk about something so let's get into it um so, but I don't have, like, I can't say, oh, well, follow this or nothing like that today. Because I don't have nothing to pay to do. So I can spill this tea. But, you know, girl, a girl got to make her coin jealous. So, uh, girl, um, let me go to Instagram right quick. No, I was on Shopify doing something because I had to fill two orders. But, um, I, well, that's fine. All right. Let's see what we got to talk about. If this is your first time here, welcome to Sip Nation. Please go ahead and subscribe if you see this on YouTube and you're not here. We do this every Monday. We talk about the girls that we don't like, and that's what we do. Okay. So the first thing we talk about is this. And I'm going to talk about this because this is the tea I have later on is about this. Now, in case y'all missed anything, I got y'all covered. Do not trip. I can catch y'all all up because I can do that. Um, 
but I will catch y'all all up on stupid and what she was doing. So the tea I'm gonna spill later has something to do with the baby mama of the of the new Zuma. Okay, so check this out. I'm gonna, so break it. I'm gonna break it down to you like this. All right. So the ba so listen. Pay attention. I don't want y'all to be fooled. I don't want y'all to get lost. So we're gonna break this down. So listen. I posted today what the ex of the new Zoomer is doing, is saying. She's saying, and allegedly she's saying that her, the ex is still calling her. Now people was like, oh, we need to see proof. We're going to believe that. So we're going to believe he not? We're going to believe stupid? That's what I'm saying. Why is we believing what stupid say? We're not believing. So we're going to believe, oh, what stupid say, just go. Let's see if stupid ever lied to us before or ever was or ever just did the dumbest thing before. She did everything, she did She did a million dumb stuff before. So we're gonna listen to what, what she talked about? No. This is my thing. I'm gonna show you what the people are saying. You can make your own determination. But, of course she wants to be zoomed in peace. I do believe, I believe a man gonna be a man. I believe that, I believe that one, and think, let me say something, and this is just my opinion. First of all, the dummy moved too fast. That's number one. You ain't get your coochie or your heart of time to heal. And that was an embarrassing and trying situation. Now, let's say, for instance, you set that situation up, which I happen to believe, too. That would explain why you moved on too fast. That's my opinion now, understandably so. I can't say stupid you moved too fast, but I think stupid moved too fast. That's just my opinion. You can't be a, like you, like, you know, your, your coochie ain't even healed up yet. Not saying that, not saying that, that like, you know, what, what, Hold on, so I say something. Official Ashley, goodbye. Go ahead. And, it's, listen, sweetheart. Official Ashley, what is it? let me add you. Because she's not always a topic. Listen, she's a topic on Mondays. She's never. So you wasn't here the last six days when we talked about all kind of other stuff. Let me tell you, girl. I'm not finna even let you give, give me out my camera to the early this goddamn go morning. Because number one, she's not always a topic. If you're of you only only of you're only alive on Monday, then sister, then she is always a topic to you. But if you live any if you live any other day of the week, six other days a week, you're serious. So actually to, to the pack, that's one seventh of the time. She's only the topic one seventh of the time. Come on, Ashley, come to the light, because I need to understand why you only alive on Mondays. That's the only thing I need to understand. The only time you may be here is on Monday because this is what you want to hear about. But guess what? We talk about other things all during the week outside of her. Okay, Miss Official Ashley Washington, let me look at your page, sister, because you're a dummy. I want to make sure you're I want because you get you're going to get blocked. So I'm just because <laughs> you don't want to come because you don't want to come live. But I want to see if I can look at your page and see how ugly you is. I just want to see. She's not always the topic. She's the hot put on Monday. Yeah, and then last Monday she really got a reprieve. To be honest with you. So you can either sit back and listen, or you can just go ahead on and get you some get you some business, child. As I'm talking about, she's not always a topic. I hear when a bitch say that she's not always a topic. She's a topic on Mondays. She's always a topic on Mondays. Correct yourself. Oh, you ain't gonna come live. You wanna say what you say, but you ain't gonna come live. Let me see you. Oh, girl. P private page. But you look like a crayon clueless. Let me go ahead and block your mom. Go find yourself to do so. This ain't for you. This ain't your. This ain't your. This ain't what you want. Let me block you. Let me block you. So, uh, like I was saying before, she was a, before the dummy come and interrupt my whole little groove. Girl, block her. Out the thing. Come on, mom. She's not always the topic, babe. <laughs> for, 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 for one, two, three, four kids and pregnant. Oh, Ashley Washington, you got some stuff with you that you need to not worry about me, huh? If you want like what I'm talking about, oh, she out of here. <laughs> yeah, she, she looked like a crayon clueless. Like, her, her makeup all fucked up, too. So, uh, she looked like a crayon clueless. She's giving me crayon clueless. So, anyway, like I was saying, let me block you, too. Hold on, let me block this bitch, too. They feel like being stupid. Hold on. Let me see. Yeah, you're gonna get blocked. Yeah, you're getting blocked. Yep. Yeah. Put them on the phone there. Yeah. I'm gonna block you too. You're doing too much.
too much already. We're doing too much. <laughs> I don't like it. Hold on. I'm coming out. As soon as I get to start talking what I want to say, bitches got something to say, bitch. Girl, good day. Block you. All right. Bitch, get up out of here. Yeah, yeah, we're not going to go for it. So, like I was saying, I forgot what I was talking about, too, girl. I really did. So, um, so, like I was saying, so, how do we know So, so we're supposed to just listen to stupid? That's all I'm saying. Like, how we know, how we know that this ain't the act, like, you know what I'm saying? How you gonna say, oh, well, look, oh, I don't believe it. Stupid ain't saying he calling her. He not calling her. Now, this is why I might believe, and it's gonna be part of my next thing that I post. This is how I believe, this is how I believe that he, this is the only thing that's making me think that he ain't calling his ex. This is the only part that's making me think he not calling it. Now the ex did say this. The ex did post this. This is what the ex is saying. This is what the ex is saying. The the girl, the girl that's super shaded. And we're not talking about the baby mama, the Beth coming up with another post because I'm about to explain all that too in my next post. Calm down. Because as we see, super reshared with the baby mama post. Anything positive or anything that she that makes her look good, she's going to make sure that it gets pushed to the light. But anything that puts another or uh, alternative or uh, spin on what she talking about, she's not. She's gonna go ahead and say, "Oh, they lying. Oh, they shaking. Oh, they hating. Oh, it's a blog. Bitch, you's the entertainer. Bitch, we talking about it. It is what it is, mom. So, and that's what. You, and if you don't like that, it is what it is. Well, as far as the zoom and the zoomy, do I believe the only chance that I think that he is not that he ain't calling the ex is this? I believe this young man is smarter than Luke. I believe that. That's the only thing that's giving me a little hope that he's smarter than Lou. Because all he got to do is all you got to do with this dummy because our self esteem so messed up. And I would say, and girl, I got some tea, girl. And I would say you ain't get your your coochie time to heal. But as y'all know, it's like with Lou, it's like with Dick Lou, it's like you don't have none. And from what I understand, I really got not 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 peep this up. I did get some more tea. It's being verified and corroborated right now. Um, when it comes to It comes to I must be busy. when it comes to when it comes to that now I want y'all to see this I want y'all to see this and this is just come to my DMs now, this is the girl, I'm going to show y'all, like, the reason why I believe her is this. I don't want to show y'all who she is yet, but I'm going to show y'all some tea. I'm going to show y'all some tea, some drops, I'm going to show y'all. Now, I'm going to show you, like, this is live in, this is live in effect. So, look, I just want to show y'all, so, oh, shit. I'm going to show y'all you, but I'm going to show y'all, like, me and this girl been talking since May 27th of 2019, right? So this ain't no new, this ain't no new sipper, this ain't no new somebody, this ain't no new, we been her been DMing back and forth since then. Hold up, I don't want you to know who it is. But listen, so we talking. All right, so she was like, oh girl, I'm showing who she is. So look, she's saying, his sex not even good. After I fucked him, I unfollow him. He is nothing, he work offshore and stay behind section eight. LL, so I don't see what the big fuss about. And his dick not big. I'm sorry. I start laughing. I said, who must like these little dick niggas? She said, yeah, because baby, his dick little, he can't fuck when I saw it was him and I fucked him in his bed. So where the girlfriend was because he had a little girl and she was there. And so listen, so we're going to get into this. 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 So as I'm, so this is what we're working on. We're trying to get into this. But, so I'm like, girl, <laughs> Is this just Zoom City, girl? What, so this is not, and before y'all go, oh, what well, she, blah, blah, blah. Listen, I said, well, listen, because I did, of course, as I normally do, I did ask for a little receipt or two. 
in the DMs as well. And the receipts are full coming. As soon as I get that, I will fold that to y'all. So listen, okay, before y'all go on, this live is sponsored by The Kingdom. It's available. If you see this on YouTube, if you catch it, if you catch it live, if you're catching this on YouTube, the link will be in the description. Y'all make sure y'all go ahead and cop the book. I don't have nothing to do. But, okay, so that's not the tea, though. I got the tea on the baby mama. Why the baby mama said what she said? Why stupid reposted it? I got all that tea and that's what's coming. So we just go, hold up. We're going to hold that before we go ahead and cancel this and table it. But we're going to get into that later. So if you're catching this on YouTube, it will be on YouTube after. But I will say this. I do I believe the ex? Now, the ex was shaded by Super with the I'll be caring and all that stuff like that. We showed y'all all that a couple few Mondays ago. I only keep the videos about them up on Mondays because I just don't. If you go, you got to catch it, screen record, screenshot what you do on Monday. If you miss it, that's on your body. It's, it is what it is. But at the same time, I will say this. Girl, I know for a fact, I just really feel like this girl, like, okay, you're bad built, you got a bad attitude. Probably bad girl, just ugly inside and out. You heard me. Like, is you telling me this man with you because he liked your stunning personality? Like, what's going on? Okay, she dropped a few files. I'm going to give her that. Cool. That's stuff. But look, I mean, like, it would be just the choker for me. I'm sorry. It just would be the choker for me. So, it's like, girl. But, you know, it's like, I, you know, and I understand nobody want to be alone. I understand, God, yada, yada, it is what it is. And nobody wants to be alone. So, sometimes, we, you know, we, we're a little standard here, too. But, girl, this is just too quick, too fast. Now, I guess you didn't need no time for your cushion to heal. But at the same time, girl, you got to get that heart sometime to heal. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> That's all I'm saying, girl. It's the choker for me. So what she did took it off, but then she put it back on. Now she got two chokers on, girl. I don't know what's going on with this this mule, girl. I don't know what's what's the tea, girl. I'm just like, oh. All right, so don't forget. So stay tuned. There will be the tea posted about the baby mama, why the baby mama posted it, and all that stuff like that. I got all the tea on that coming. Y'all know how to do so. That should be hitting the, that should be hitting the airwaves. That should be hitting the um the page around 3 o'clock. Make sure you have notifications on. Let's talk about our next story Uh, when it comes to that just I tend to believe that he not as stupid as Luke. And I know, and look, pay attention. Pay attention. I have reports confirming. Now they talking about he worked this place and all this stuff like this. I have I have confirmation proof. Brother has not worked since June. How about that? No, no, July. Seven months? Yep. I have confirmation proof he haven't worked since July. What is you talking about? He ever been also since, it might have been June. I think it's seven months though. Okay, no comment. I'm going to post it when I post it. But he had, so what is y'all talking about? He got all this. He he got the, I see him with the crown, crown clue, clueless shirt on. Walk around, <laughs> lifting packages up and stuff. So he haven't worked since, he haven't worked offshore since June. Why am I saying June? Hold on, let me get that up. Let me see that receipt, oh, the receipt on this phone here. <laughs> it's on this phone, hold on. So we have, so what is your, so what y'all mean? Which I mean, let's just, it, let's just say July. I'm gonna give him the benefit of the doubt. I don't know if it's June or July right now, but you ever worked since July offshore? So, what y'all talking about? Make it make sense. Like, like the simple thing, like you just because you stupid don't mean simulation is. Okay, I ain't never seen Lou in a crayon shirt either. I showed sure Lou in a wash my wash my smoke shirt. Never in a crayon shirt. All right. So, okay. Now, the next story we talked about a little recap was Lala. Now, Lala, you have go ahead. Let me say something, sister. You, 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 bitch. You're doing deals with the devil. All money ain't good money. It is what it is. So, Lala posted, girl. Don't lick my name and don't mess. I'm not getting. I'm getting money and mind in my business. Girl, Miss Long Pussy herself said, listen, I don't want no smoke, girl. Y'all go sit down. Me and Candy was just getting our coin dollars, girl. We don't know nothing about what's going on. We don't want nothing. We don't want no. We don't want no. We don't want no smoke. 
All right, Lala, we're going to go ahead and take that, put that pussy in rehab, and we'll feel much better about you, girl. It's kind of long, sir. We don't got no issue with you, girl. You ain't doing this. You make us laugh. You give us a little kicky and a little giggle, giggle sometimes. But, girl, your, your partners and stuff, you got to watch. And this is for all you This is for all you influencers that might think, girl, don't think this girl, don't think. She ain't going to help you. You might think she going to leave you out to dry. She going to pay you your little coin, dollars, girl. You going to be doing your little thing. Yeah, get, put the drops in my head. Got the drops in my head. And then, girl, and then here we coming. <laughs> so, sister, you got the, it's stretching, girl. It's, it's just stretching. I don't know, girl. It's stretchable, girl. It must be elastic or play down there, girl. I don't know what's, girl, girl. <laughs> you might need to have that same surgery with Sierra. Um, that same surgery Savannah had, girl. <laughs> So I, I don't know. So um all them discolorations and stuff, girl. I don't know. I don't know. It's long girl, it's long, girl. It's long, girl. Girl. Whoo, child. So sister, she she went ahead and cop my little plea, girl. She's like, don't let me to the mess. I gotta do, I don't have no parts. I don't want no parts. Y'all do whatever it is y'all doing, girl. This thing got nothing to do with me. I'm just going over here minding my business. Okay. So, <laughs> so, all right, sister, we're going to go ahead and we're going to go ahead. You, you're going to, we're not going to talk about your messy money no more, girl. You did what you, you know, you, you know, you cleared it up. I make a bitch clear it up. We cleared it up. We cleared it up. <laughs> you cleared it up. Like, bitch, I'm minding money. I'm minding. I'm getting money. This, I'm here for the money. So, listen. <laughs> Let me say y'all something. Y'all talk about okay. I don't. I'm not. So Breaky, Breaky or whatever her name is, she she's not a discussion of messy Monday. Um, she went ahead and you know she's really just not that important. So we talk about somebody else. But I will say this. Notice something. Notice something. Pay attention. You know. Listen. This is how you know a nigga is using you, especially with your internet celebrities or whatever the case may be. You, you know how they you how you could tell they. Being zoomed, you know how I'm gonna tell y'all how they how people you could. Yeah, yeah, I'm not saying that about Brookie, this is not nothing against Brookie. She we talked about her the day we need to talk about her. I found I, I said what I said, why I said it. It's it is what it is. We're not talking about her. I'm just talking about in general. She's we have no Brookie, you all right with us. We have no issue with you, Brookie. We've stayed, we, you know, y'all stay with y'all. Y'all posted y'all shade. I posted my shade. I think it's done. We good. Y'all going about your business. I'm going about but, but your business. I don't have no problem with you outside of that issue. Or whatever, whatever. So this is not saying that. But you could tell. Let me show you something. This is how you know that they're being Zoom. When your favorite celebrities and you want to know if they're being Zoom, I'm about to tell you how you know they're being Zoom. It's so easy to just find out. You will never see the niggas at their house. Not, understand what I'm saying. You will see, let's just say, in the case of Bricky and her nigga. Where his house at? Why you never see him at his house? Why are they both never at his house? Why are they all at their house all the time? Why are you always at her house all the time? Why are you always on her trips all the time? Why we never see you at his house? Why? That's just, it go for her friend too. Stupid. Why we never see you at his house? So you say he not zooming you. So you say he got his own. Why are you never over there? Why he always at your house? Why are he always in your business? Why are we never see you go to the, drop him off to the offshore? Why are we never see you? I'm just saying, we never see him do nothing that is for him. Even on their own pages, you always see them in association. Just, just, just saying. Tell me if I'm wrong. When have we ever seen them do something, even on their own, their own pages? It's like a fan page dedicated to the person they're zooming. PK, I'm not the only one. If you ain't just noticed that. You got to, let me see, let me see you, let's go, why would y'all never go to your kids' house? Why y'all never go, go do something that's for him to do? Go go to the offshore with him, or something. Even on his page, it's all about what y'all doing at your places of business. I'm just saying, if I'm wrong, say I'm wrong, and I'm going to go sit down. But bitch, if, 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 bitch, if I'm right, bitch, give me my, girl, go ahead and give me a little heart or something, bitch. Give me a bitch. Give me a little bitch. Yes, bitch. Just tell me. Y'all never over there. If you're in a relationship, sometimes you go. So, so, 
sometimes you go over there to your, if you're in a relationship with somebody, sometimes you go to their house. Sometimes you go see their people. Sometimes you go do stuff that they want to do. That's not, that's not lovers. That's not relationship, bitch. That's employees, bitch. I'm just, what? Sometimes, what your mom and them cook? Fuck with Shirley cook. What your mom and them cook today? I got to eat over there too sometimes. We'll see. We'll see. She was there when? Where? 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 Girl, I got notifications on. When, girl? I want a screenshot. Okay, just tell me when. I'm trying to fix. I'm trying to see when, girl. So I know. Oh, you talking about Bricky? Oh, okay, girl. One day last month. Okay. <laughs> Now, after they see, you know they ain't here, right? So after they see this, they're gonna go do, they're gonna go get them, they're gonna go rent them a little, a little, <laughs> a little Airbnb or something, girl. They're gonna do this. This is what I'm, I'm saying. Y'all listen to me. Hear me out. <laughs> Hear me out. She was in a random bed one day. Hear me out. Hear me out. This was gonna happen after this live. Listen. They're going to go rent an Airbnb. That's what I'm telling you. What's going to happen? And they're going to be like, oh, we here. <laughs> Just, oh, here's his house. They're going to do this. I make them clean up whatever. I make them clean up what they messed up. <laughs> so this is what's going to I'm just saying what's going to happen. Y'all going to see. There's going to be a video posted. Not today. But you're going to wait till like Thursday or something. You know, the middle of the week. And they're going to have an Airbnb. It's going to be nice girl looking. It's going to be like, ooh, ooh. And they're going to be like, yes, girl. Oh, I'm over here at his house. Girl, I'm at his place cooking. Watch. Watch what's going to happen. I'm telling y'all what's going to happen. She was at a hotel with him, not his house. Girl, okay, that's what I'm trying to see. So, that's what's going to happen. Girl. So, you tell me one time? <laughs> Properties? Carry on. Promise. Promise. All right. <laughs> okay. Y'all go ahead and buy this book, girl. Go, go ahead and buy this book, girl, so I can pay for the one property I do have. Because y'all please buy the book, girl. Because y'all buy the book, please. It's available on Amazon, The Kingdom by Rodney Russo. <laughs> All right. Next story. Girl, everything about this girl is cheesy and just is trifling, girl. Everything about this girl, properties, girl. Everything. So she has properties. Oh, hold on. 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 All right. So, so everything about this girl is just cheesy and trifling, girl. Amazon smart. <laughs> everything about this girl. Hey, that boo -boo. All right. So let me just say this. I don't know who told you this was cute. I don't know who put this together for you. I'm just, I'm giving you the benefit of doubt that you didn't do this yourself, Mo. 
But bitch, this is just nasty. It's just trifling. It don't fit you. It's just too much going on. You lie like you knock needed and your bow legged at the same damn time. It's not it's not working. Bitch, you just look like you stank and uncomfortable. Bitch, I know for real you still got a crumb or two in that nasty ass. Girl, I'm just like, it just don't go for me. I have no idea. What the fuck? Who told you do this to yourself? But this shit is so trifling. Everything about you is classless and tasteless. This is so ghetto and stupid. I don't know how. Listen, this is just, listen, black businesses. Let me tell y'all something. This ain't the way. Don't let a bitch fool you. Do not let a bitch fool you into thinking this is real. If this is what you dropping us knowledge on or how to be stupid bitches wearing peacocks on our head trying to sell people something that don't work, bitch, okay, that's dropping knowledge. But how dare you sit your stupid ass up there and try to do... Girl, that is ugly and dumb. And whoever told you do it, fire them. Whoever told you it was cute or you look good, fire them. Whoever told you this was marketing or something, fire them. Them white people are laughing at you. You are a buffoon. Stop doing that. That is not how that go. Let me tell you something. This bitch don't have decency for herself as a black woman. This woman doesn't have decency for herself as a black business owner or a black brand. She's a dummy. It's supposed to be beauty. Girl, she's supposed to be beauty. I know she's the beast, bitch. Not, not, you can't be beauty with, bitch, the NBC, with, with the NBC peacock sitting on top of your head, looking like a fucking fool, talking about Walmart. Walmart don't need you to promote them, sis. They got a big billionaires over there. So like you sitting up there stupid, this, that girl, what the fuck? Bitch, how dare you? You make a fool of yourself some fucking Walmart. So you excited, so Walmart taking a penitential chance on them goddamn dead drops. But bitch, let me tell you something. You don't see the there are the Walmart sell a million products. What CEO of any of those products? You go to Walmart, you buy Clorox. Do you see the CEO of Clorox walking around wearing a big bleach bottle? No. Do you see Do you see the CEO of Nabisco walking around with or like a big Oreo? No. Do you see the C? What else Walmart sell? Bitch, Walmart sell everything. Do you see, they sell iPhone? Do you see Tim Cook ass walking around with a big motherfucking with a fucking iPhone on? Do you see Samsung CEO his Chinese ass walking around as a big TV? No. You don't see no CEO. Of no company, major company, walk around doing some dumb shit like that. That is so stupid. That surgery ain't work. That detox ain't work. I don't know what the fuck. You still look chunky and cheesy as fucking hell. And you got all that fucking yellow on blue. Bitch, you giving me Kraft America cheese, bitch. I want to take you out, take a slice of you, and put it on a piece of bread, bitch. How dare you sit up there, you cheesy trifling bitch. I can't stand a dumb bitch. Let me tell you something. That is not black business. Black business, we need to be respected and be entrepreneurial. And you up in there, you won't make Walmart richer. They don't give a fuck. They laughing at you. Your business is predicated on the backs of you selling. And see, this is the reason. And don't be so stupid. This, this is the people, this is what I can't stand about the motherfucking. The, see, the crayon clueless, they're clueless. But I can, I can honestly say this. I don't see, outside of wearing that clown makeup herself, I don't see stupid running around here, walking around here trying to gimmick you into buying that shit. She'll tell you, like, bitch, this is for amateurs, bitch. We're just putting some shit on her face and hope it look good. Bitch, this is, you put a crayon on your face and it might be something. I can respect that super. <laughs> okay? Bitch, hold on. Stay right there. Bitch, I can respect that. They both available at Walmart. Who wore I'm going to show them put this side by side. I promise you I'll do this and be like, who wore it best? Who wore it best? Who wore it best, bitch? Who wore it best, bitch? Who wore it best? I promise you. Who wore it? I'm going to do that. That's going to be my next post, bitch. Who wore it? Who, who wore the motherfucker best, bitch? Who wore it best, bitch? <laughs> who promote for free? Super ain't even dressed up like the crayon yet. She now nah, she throw that she throw that fuckery on her face, breaking all her skin out with that with all them different colors and shit. But bitch, you that you bitch, that's the captain going down with your motherfucking ship. Bitch, I promise you, they said the cheese would better, bitch. Stop it, girl. The cheese would better, bitch. So they both available at Walmart. So look, 
Girl, you was a dummy. That is not, let me tell y'all something. Let me tell y'all something. You know what? I'm about to break something down to y'all real, real quick. Stupid sell clown makeup. If you want to look like a clown, buy the makeup. No tea. It's not hard. You get your, you get your product. It is what it is. No, you can't get mad <laughs> that you're looking like a clown. You bought the clown. You bought the clown makeup. This is the problem that we have with foodie. The drops don't work. That's why she is constantly using all kind of gimmicks. Storylines, children, remakes of videos. It's gimmicks because the shit don't work. When your shit work, people is going to get it anyway. You feel what I'm saying? You don't have to gimmick them. You don't have to dress up and look, making yourself look like a box of craft cheese. Let me tell you something. I'm going to prove this to you right now. And listen, you would be able to use it yourself. And say, listen, I use my product. You can show proof that your products is being used by you. You wearing wigs. Oh, buy this. This will make your hair grow. I wear wigs. Don't pay no mind to me. But I'm going to wear wigs and stuff. I'm going to wear wigs and stuff. But I'm going to gimmick you so you can buy this to make your hair grow. But I'm going to wear the wig. I don't know about you. I don't care about you. I'm, you don't have to do all that. I'm going to prove something. I don't even do this. But I'm going to prove something to y'all. Because I'm going to prove to you about my product. Now, I do market my product. I do show it, this, that, and the other, that, when I have to market it. But I don't market it like, you don't see me doing no gimmicks, right? You don't see me You don't see me doing nothing that's stupid, basically. You don't see me trying to pay this celebrity or pay this person for no reviews or come out dressing like a box of craft cheese or, or making myself look stupid, got snakes coming out my twat. You don't see me doing none of that, right? Now, of course, I can never show you sales like stupid and all that i can't show you that but i'm gonna show you what i really do and i'm a, i don't even do this so um let me see pull up this is my actual this this is my fucking this is my shopify page this is my shopify page so hold on i'm gonna pull it up what is that beeping the fuck <laughs> So I'm gonna do a whole. I'm gonna do all my for all this year. Okay. This all right. So this for the whole year. This is my sales for the whole year. October first. Okay. Do from January first to October first. This is how many people come. But let me show you. The, I'm gonna show you what's the what's the real part about this. This right here. Returning customer rate. I don't have to do no gimmicks because people gonna come back. That means more than half the people that fuck with me. More than half the people that fuck with me, they coming back. I don't have to do no gimmicks. I ain't gotta lie to you. I don't have to come in. Oh, this person promote. Oh, I ain't gotta do none of that. That means people that buy, if I sold them a product. There's a 50%, there's 60% chance they're coming back to buy another product. Because it works. I don't have to make you, I don't have to, I don't have to get a celebrity endorser. I don't have to come on here with no makeup on, or no wig, or no filter. My skin is my skin. When my skin has product problems, I put my products on. If it works, then this is what you see. You're not seeing no, you're not seeing no, Oh, who did they be blocked? Oh, girl, you know I'm a blocking bitch. Oh, girl, you know where's the block party? I couldn't find him. whoever was looking for. I couldn't find him. screenshot. I'm gonna block him. But anyway, <laughs> screenshot says with Frederick because you know what to do. Um,
You ain't got to do nothing. So look, I ain't got to do all that. Now, before a bitch starts sending me a request for money or anything like that, no one thing. Sales do not mean profit. Understand that, okay? Before y'all do any of that, we're not going to do that. Sales do not mean it's profit. Doesn't matter I have that in my pocket. No, my, no, no, no. Let me say you, my biggest seller is a, my biggest seller is the, my biggest seller, my biggest seller is the tea bag, and I don't make a lot of money on the tea bag. So before y'all go ahead and say that, that's not profit, that's sales. There's a difference. It costs money to get that, and a lot of that money. And I'm gonna show y'all. I'm not gonna be. We're gonna be real. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I'm not stunting on nobody. I'm just telling you, start your business. You could do whatever you wanna do, but I'm gonna show you what you could do. I'm not comparing. My bag to stupid or nothing. I'm not doing none of that. This is just what I'm saying. Most of them sales came in March and April, as you can see. They've been going down. I don't, I don't know, whatever, whatever. Like, whatever, whatever. But I want to show y'all something. That's the average order value. That's the amount of orders. That's when they come back. So, listen. I'm not comparing what she do. That was me for March. And most of them orders came in March and April when we first started our store. But all our customers is repeat customers. They're coming back customers. So, so before a bitch send me some money... Talk about, oh, bitch, give me some money. You got me all this. No, we didn't reach $100,000 worth of sale yet. We need about um, <laughs> so we need about six tea bags to be sold, I hope. And see, y'all also have to realize that I do promote our products. Uh, most of my sales come in at, when I do my high 99. Every night I do high 99, two or three sales come in. And that's cool because I'm one person. I'm scaling to my level. Okay, so don't think that. No, I didn't do no overnight million. Not, no, no, no. But I will say this, I didn't have to gimmick or sell my soul for it. I ain't got to use no children. I don't even have children, no children finna even advertise me. That's not even what's going on. They had one little girl. She posted all my products because she used um, the charcoal mask. She liked the charcoal mask. She was a little girl, 14. I contacted her and said, what's your mama? What's up? And I gave her mama the rate, my rate of promotion for that. I paid that little girl. Even though she didn't ask for nothing, she just posted it. I noticed the post, and I paid the little girl because she was a, a, a child. If you're a child, you should be compensated for your thumb. I appreciate that. Now I don't do that for I don't do that for y'all grown ass people, but uh, for the little kids I do. But I don't have no children promoting for me. I'm not gonna dress up in clown suits and stuff like that. I'm not gonna do all this dumb stuff or, de or degrade my brand so much. Not myself, that's something different. But degrade myself and my brand so much just because I got into a white people store because and making myself look stupid to promote their stuff. Why am I not gonna promote you? Why am I not gonna do that for you? Walmart, have, Walmart has been known for closing black businesses the whole time. This is something exciting for you. I was more happy the bitch was in San than that. But you're going to sit up there and you're going to make sure you're a dude, you classless and buffoonery going to go up in there. Don't you know, bitch, you, bitch, listen, you two or three half, bitch, that's just sizzle people here. This stupid bitch, two or three half follicles away from a class action lawsuit, and you so excited you're in Walmart, girl, you got to go sit down. If you was really excited and you was really good, you was really happy you were selling, and you was really happy that your product is working for people, especially black people, not only would you show other people how to do it or provide inspiration on how to do it, like like I would have just better be like, listen, I would feel, I swear to God, I would have been more excited for her or more help her and she said, listen, y'all, I got my, it comes to us like a strong businesswoman instead of a fool or a dummy and say, listen, y'all, I finally got my product in Walmart. This is a big thing. Uh, would y'all like to, I'll do a class or something and let y'all know the, the process of us going into how you get your stuff into Walmart. Yeah, girl, you too, girl, this girl, this go two or three follicles away from a class that can also talk about I'm, I'm dressing up as a peacock talking about Walmart. Like Walmart will feel like, oh, girl, look at you. No, Walmart left like you, you stupid bitch, because Walmart makes you, so listen, her products cost $20 on her website, but watch this. Walmart makes you sell it to them for $2. They're going to still sell it for 20 But even though Amazon, guess what Amazon do? They all do this. You can't sell the your product even on your own. Amazon do this because they're doing that with my book. My book is available on Amazon for $15. Hardcover with, uh, I think, $10 on the Kindle. 
I could sell my book, but if I get caught even on my own website selling my book for $13, they're going to take me off of Amazon. They make you, you can't sell the product for less than they sell it for in their stores or they're going to take you off their stores. So it's not like, you know, you got the, so I'm letting y'all know the game. While y'all sitting up there, oh, oh, Lord, you're dressed like a peacock. Congratulations. You're dressed like a box of Kraft American cheese, bitch. Y'all both in Walmart. Don't think everything glitters the gold. Because what Walmart does, even though they buy a lot of your products to put on their shelves, but guess what? If it don't sell, they're going to send it back to you and they want to go and want a refund. Don't think it's just like, oh, I'm just getting it Walmart and that's the world. Yes, ma'am. Walmart not going to let you sell it for less on your own website than they do at Walmart. Don't think that's not what they're going to do. You're not going to even sell it even on your own website. Just let y'all know. So while she's sitting up here looking like the beast from Beauty and the Beast, bitch, like she needs to go on somebody fucking cartoon some fucking well, like she just come from a Nickelodeon shoot, bitch. Guess what, sir? You was a dummy. And bitch, don't think, and this is another thing, you big dummy. The liability for when, <laughs> and so, oh, bitch, that's free games. You got to pay for that drop and now that's just common kind of motherfucking sense. Don't make, you don't let the thing, don't let the, don't let the dumb bitches fool you like they doing something, girl. All they're doing is fucking over you and playing in your face. Bitch, you're not finna send me a drop and you don't wear. You're not finna, bitch, I can't, I'm not finna tell you nothing that I don't wear or use my goddamn stuff all the time. Don't think about it. <laughs> Fuck. Bitch, Amazon do the same thing. <laughs> so understand. Don't be no dummy. Who in their right mind go buy drops and tops from a bitch that don't wear the drops or the tops, bitch? I would love to see her Shopify. I want to see the returning customer rate. That's all I want to know. Because that's what's telling. I can see your sales and you doing all this. That's good. Cute. I need to see what the ret That's the important thing. That tells you who fucking with you. Where your money coming from. You constantly got to find new customers. Not that you have customers coming back. It do seem like I hear I am, baby. But listen, I'm also, so listen, E.I., Mo, I'm a hater, but I'm also a blocker, bitch. Thanks for joining you, bitch, you. Good day. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm a blocker, too. I'm a hater and a blocker. <laughs> I'm a hater and a blocker. How about that? I'm a hater and a blocker. I'm two things. Mosey says, I can hate and block at the same time. See how easy that was? Now you got to go find you something to do. Go find you something to do. You could have been here sipping with all the rest of us, chilling, jostling, laughing at these dumb assholes, playing in people's face. Girl, but no. You won't, <laughs> you won't, you, you won't be a dummy. <sighs> I won't see that return customer rate. That's what I won't see. I won't say that, that percentage. Minus 60%. Oh, thank you, Casey. That's water, that's not tea. Girl, maybe you don't even eat cheese no more, girl. Big cheesy bitch. Girl. If the drops under the tongue for me, the average is supposed to I'm gonna go see. <laughs> girl, who wore it best, girl? Who wore it best, girl? I'm about to put that up. Who wore it best, girl? Yeah, Wiley, you two seconds for being blocked. I did not make the wig away. Like I told y'all today, I had some uh, a pre existing condition. <laughs> no, my son, they was talking about the Medicare. Okay, so, all right. So, my BM, where she work at, he's under her health care. But when he went to the hospital for COVID, they was trying to say we owe for that. Baby, I, and so she, she was like, I don't know what to do. I'm like, girl, hold on. Let me call these people and, told them, and tell them what to do. Give me the, give me the number. And so I called her and bitch, I was airing them out all morning. Like, y'all got y'all not about to play with us. 
<laughs> Don't get fired, sister. <laughs> bitch, I don't even want to eat cheese, my bitch. And I love me some cheese, y'all stuff, girl. Cheese dance, bitch. This bitch. Who's that? <laughs> Available at your nearest Walmart. Yeah, she don't use it. Why would you? Who buys stuff from a bitch you don't even use? Girl. How you gonna sell hair growth? This girl stay long and healthy with a wig on. I don't get it. Big. Hold on. Who told you big? Baby, y'all gotta stop fussing the comments. Y'all gotta stop fussing the comments. Oh yeah, that's the next thing I'm gonna post that too. So while Miss Miss Craft, I mean Miss uh, yeah, girl. Girl, I, I've been patiently waiting on that. I've been patiently waiting on that, girl. I've been patiently waiting on that. So, Brad E. Cheese, yeah, she just take the B off, girl. Okay. I don't know. So, um, somebody asked, someone asked her, did her grandbaby use them drops? I hope she don't put that in there, baby. Hey. <laughs> Shit, can they build me for COVID? Yeah, you could call and fuss. If you went to the hospital for COVID, they're gonna send you a bill, but when you call and fuss, they go, um, they're gonna fix it. If you have insurance now, I don't know. I mean, I guess it's a different insurance. I don't know what the fuck does she have. Um some shit, girl. Let's put the cheese back in the cheese. Okay. The box, Walmart. <laughs> All right, so. <laughs> okay. So. All right, so this has been the first half of our Messy Monday. Um, I have some tea that's about to come out. Uh, as y'all know, um, I'm going to post this. I'm going to talk about, I'm going to do some commentary on the post and the delete that she did from Brett. I don't know. I think I got it in my phone. If I don't, I might need your help. I know what it was. I know I screenshotted it, but it's so much stuff that I got in this motherfucking phone that I got on everybody. Um, and I will post um, about the stupid baby mama boyfriend that all stuff so we can understand it better. Alright? So I love y'all. Boom. Don't forget, this live is sponsored by The Kingdom by Rodney Joseph Russell, by Rodney MC Shaky Russell. It's available on Amazon. Uh, if you did miss the earlier parts of the recap, it will be available on YouTube shortly. I love y'all. Yes, it's going on YouTube. And I will talk to y'all later this afternoon. Don't forget the Hot 99 tonight on YouTube. Uh, and I'll talk to you later. Thank you. I got the green. I went back to my messy green. You already know. Messy green in the building. Oh, yes, B. When I got that best green on, bitch, don't get in my way. You need to start checking your DM. Okay, I will check your DDR. <laughs> okay, I, I, I do. I have. Listen, mom. Girl, I'm not trying to be funny. I'm not trying to be crazy. But, sis, I get a lot of DMs. So. I get a lot of DMs. It's so hard. It's so hard. It's really hard. So, I'm going to see what you put in my DM. Oh, you put one thing in my... I talked about that, sister, that stuff with Nene. You need to start paying attention, mom. So would you put my DMs, baby? It's something I discussed already. I get a lot of DMs. I get a lot of DMs. I have a lot of DMs. Sister, I'm not trying to play y'all. I'm not trying to be funny. And a lot of times y'all be putting stuff in my DMs that I didn't been able to talk about already, just like that. So that was a whole waste of time. 
I talked about that already. I have a lot of things. The stuff she talking about that she put in the in the DM is is in the like I talked about. That. Do you listen to Jaguar right? Yeah. We're going to say that for Wicked Wednesday. I'm going to go. Uh, I have some stuff about Jaguar, right? So I'm going to talk about that Wednesday. It's not a message on the topic, but probably about Wednesday, I'm going to talk about Jaguar, right? What I think about that, we could talk about it at the High 99. Um, do I believe Jaguar? Yeah, I saw that, but about nothing. But nothing want to know about it for. Uh, he wanted to shave him to talk about it. All right, so, yeah, what she was talking about, that's, I talked about that already. She said, check your DMs. No, I talked about it already. You got to check, you got to keep up. Keep up. YouTube is your friend. YouTube is your friend. Follow on YouTube. Did you talk about Lisa Ray, Brett, and Julia? Yep. I talked about it the night it happened. Hot 99. I forgot what night it was, but it's on the Hot 99. I did talk about it. The night it happened, we talked about it. The night it happened. So if you go to last Monday Hot 99 on YouTube, I talked about it. Yep. Who lying? What time are we making this cake for? I gotta go get the stuff. So I might go get it later. YouTube is your friend. Super says she used Judy Drops on her baby hair. I doubt that seriously. <laughs> I doubt that seriously. Would you use them drops on your baby hair? Come on now. What about Messi? Confused. Messi confused there. Messi has always Messi C has always said he was bisexual. Always. He's never not said that. He has children. He's always said he's bisexual. How is that confusing? There are people that like men and women. What's going on, Win Twins? Where y'all been at? How you doing? Hi, 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 hi. Okay. Bisexual. Usually, he talks about having women. Why did you start blogging? I blogging started me. I didn't start blogging. <laughs> she probably used blue magic and water, old school. So why, why, why? why? How is Messi C confused? Unless you confused. He's all, ever since I've known him, he's talked about women and men. He likes women and men. He's not confused. Dollar sign MC Shaky. <laughs> What's my cash up? Dollar sign MC Shaky. <laughs> okay. Okay, you can't. But let me tell you something. She says, but no, I can't. I don't fucking no nigga that come lay under me. But guess what? Guess what they're doing without you knowing, Lady Moore? They're fucking niggas and then come and lay with you. Who exiles by Rachel Ray? Who said that? All right, that 504 girl. How is Messi C confused? He's not confused. He's always said he likes men and women. But guess what them niggas like for real? So now, because of somebody like Messi C that's being truthful and honest about it, you get to make a choice. The girl he's with has made the choice that she wants to be with him knowing what up. And you have to respect that because there's niggas out here that's fucking these punks. Punks ain't fucking they self. Punks is fucking other fuck, punks is fucking niggas. Niggas is fucking punks. This is what's happening. And so whether you like it or not, it's what's happening. And so with that being said, by the fact that it's happening, guess what? There's many women probably in here, probably all over. Not that's probably dealt with a man. That's dealt with a man. So the fact 
that he's being truthful, you have to respect that. This is who I am. And the fact that she can accept that, you have to respect that even more. Because she has the choice, and that's her choice to know. If they're safe and they're loving and they're in a relationship, that's right. I support it. That's not a wrong thing. This is not a bad thing. This is not news. These niggas is running around here fucking punk shit. This is what's happening. It's not, not happening. You don't want to talk about it, but it's happening. Understand that. You may not like it, but it's happening. You can't deny that it's happening. And so the fact that you have one and see, this is the problem. This is why these niggas do this to y'all. Women, I'm telling y'all. This is why. This is why we have a DL problem. Because of what y'all just say. Here you have a grown-ass man that's truthful about his sexuality. And you have a grown-ass woman that accepts him in his truth. And we talk about them confused. That's wrong. That's man. Blah, blah, I would never. Blah, blah, blah. So the men that is DL, that is bisexual, or have feelings for women and men, or like men and women, is scared to tell y'all the truth and let it be your decision. Because they hear y'all say in here all around, oh, look at him, that's net. Oh, well, she's stupid. She dumb. She's not dumb. She made a decision. You dumb when you ignore that it's not happening. You're dumb. Now, if you, but, but, but if you could accept their decision or how they want to live their life, that's cool. Oh, well. But then you might have men more inclined to tell you the truth and let it be your decision. It might, so instead of saying, oh, all right, that's cute. They have an a, 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 a honest relationship where they're being honest with each other, and that's cool. Instead of being like, oh, girl, oh, girl, look at her. I would never. And if you would never find that's your choice. So, she, so who you need to be talking about, oh, girl, blah, blah, is the ones that's not knowing. The, the niggas running around here fucking them, and they not knowing. That's not, that's the problem. But it ain't the niggas' fault. And I'm saying it again. It's not the niggas' fault. It's, 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 it's y'all as females who don't have an accepted open mind. Because the only, there is no cure to niggas being on a DL other than 100% acceptance. Black people. When we start accepting that there are alternative sexualities, when we start, when we start expect, accepting that people live differently, when we start ex accepting that, then the niggas ain't gonna have a need to be on the DL. You gotta figure, you gotta understand it. But as long as we think people who live different than we do is a bad thing, and we talk about them in negative connotations, then guess what? The brothers who are DL, they're gonna always be DL. You feel what I'm saying? They're only DL because they're not accepted. They have the, they have the feelings for men. They're gonna do that. That's something that's in them that you're probably not gonna change. They might have attractions to men. They might have attractions to men and women. People are like that. People, the, we have first of all, we have a, the wrong connotation. First, we think anybody who have that black people refuse to acknowledge that people can be bisexual or trans, bisexual or pansexual, which is people that like both men and women. They, they think if you like a man, you can't possibly like a woman. And that's just not true in life. I have two kids. I love women. I have found women attractive. I think I am gay now. But part of that is because I realize how much hurt it causes when women can't understand that, that tenet of my sexuality. I'm probably bisexual. I'm probably pansexual. I don't know. Because I do like a stud too. But at the same time, I don't I I, I just identify as gay because it's more easier for people to understand. Because they can't understand that I could really be bisexual. Black people don't get it. Black people have a problem with accepting that people like can, can men anyway can like a man and a woman. I have two kids that I created with my cock. Truly living. Two, with two different women. But I've been in a relationship with four different women in my life. A relationship. I say I think because I can't explain it. Like, how do I explain to you what I feel about women? The only thing you can say is that you. I know I like men, but I can't explain to you 
if I explain to you like what I feel about women as far as attraction level and stuff like that, because a pussy and a booty is two different things. It's two. It's not the same. I tend to like both. And so, but, but because people so they they oh it can't be you got to like one or the other. I just be like I'm gay because it's so easier for them to just figure it out. Like okay, I'm gay and it's it's just no problem. Y'all get it. I'm fitting into the to the thing. Is that a lie? To me, no. Is that just not? But it's also it's just easier for y'all to understand, or not y'all, but black people in general. I don't understand. Well, I'm okay. I'm gay, but you see me with a man, but okay, blah blah blah. And so whatever. I don't even think this is. I find I, my my yeah get hard for women too. When was the last time you had some cooch? Really, not too long ago, like a couple years ago, really. So, the, so, so back to this DL thing. People are only DL. Nineteen and twelve. Nineteen make it twenty, and just turn twelve. Would I consider myself bisexual? I just would consider myself shaky. To be honest with you. I, I, just, I guess I can say I like men more because I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't like the heartbreak of men. And I don't like the heartbreak I cause women when I want to have a man. So it's kind of like I'm fucked. Um, or whatever. So maybe I'm just bi. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, but if you need to label, I'm gay. I mean, I like men. I like men. I like women different. So shake you're not a big messy punk then. No, I'm a big messy punk. I'm still I'm a big messy punk. <laughs> I'm a big messy punk. No no step. I'm a big messy punk. Ain't no <laughs> ain't no if ands does about that one. I'm a, I'm I'm cool with a label, I don't care. If you if 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 you need um if if you feel better that I'm gay, I'm gay. If you feel better that I'm bi, I'm bi. It's, it's, it doesn't hurt the type of way or whatever, whatever. I'm only talking about this. This is all I'm talking about. Okay? This is all I'm talking about. And I'm going to hurry up and say this and go. Because I got stuff to do. And I want to post some stuff. So... Watch this. Black women, I have heard from y'all, and I've heard y'all loud and clear. I understand, I've witnessed it, and I hear from y'all. I listen to y'all. And trust me, black women, y'all. I know y'all think I tear down black women. That's not true. I tear down these two bitches because I don't like them, and I don't even consider, one of them I don't even consider a woman, and the other one I'm just not so sure. I consider one of them a black monster because you wouldn't do that to black kids if you was a black woman. No black woman. Let me say something about a black woman. One thing about a black woman, which, especially a black mother, when you pass that echelon of motherhood, you understand. You will take somebody else's child as your own because that motherhood is, is instilled in you. I've seen it. With not only my baby mamas, but I've seen it with my sister. Like, I could tell you, like, the day Tiff changed was the day she became a mother. She went, boom, to, she's a peacock today, okay? <laughs> Period. She's a peacock today. So, wait, what did it do to the two kids? That's well documented on YouTube. You have to go to YouTube and find it. Just look up MC Shaker and Collider or uh, Collider Kids, and you'll, you'll see a lot of stuff. That's well documented what she did to the kids. Lil James, Mama, all that. It's over there. Um... All the Kalata kids, it's over there. It's well documented. I'm not going to answer it on here. Um, but as a mother, once you cross that, I, I like literally saw my sister change from big body, all about Tiff world to everybody kid I love, <laughs> like overnight. You know what I'm saying? So as a mother, you, and, and motherhood to me is one of the epitomes of, of being a woman. And so, 
with that being said, it's like, I can't consider you a mother because how could you want to do this to somebody else's kid? How could you, because even as a father, I want to love your kid. I want to love all kids. Like, I understand it. Like, kids is real, real off limits to me. Real, real, I, I take that very seriously. But to see what she did for these, to these children, to these kids, that shit, you know, that convicted my spirit. And so I don't consider her a woman because you, I don't consider you a mother. I can't consider you a woman because one thing about women, especially black women, they'll take care of not only, you, I ain't never saw a real black woman. If a kid hungry or needs something to eat, be like, baby, come get you something to eat. I never saw that. I don't know if that exists, and I'm sure it does in, in the world. And that don't have to be her kid. That could be a kid her kid playing with. Tell them, come on, boy, what you want? Boy, we got food over here. I never saw that. I, I don't know how that is. So I guess this hurt me because I saw this from her doing this to this. Like, and this is a black mother and who was in a bad situation, and you took advantage of her and the situation. Yes, of course. Yes. My daughter is obviously my daughter knows, and I'm, I'm pretty sure my son gets it too. Um, even though we haven't had that talk for real yet, it's not a secret I keep. So as a mother, so that's why I don't consider them, I don't even consider her a real woman. I can consider her some type of monster, or like you see a peacock. So, 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 with, with that being said, it's like, trust me, black women, y'all don't have a bigger champion than Shaky outside of, 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 of black women. So, okay, you know what I'm saying? There's black women, and and then there's the, the, the black women who do so amazing, because I believe, personally, black women are the most, like, y'all get it the worst. Y'all, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all, like, y'all got to... So many standards. Some of the black women have to be fathers, mothers. They have to go through stuff and be more and, and, and stronger than any white woman, white man, or black man, if you ask me. So to me, black woman, and if y'all know, if you read what it's saying, mitochondrial Eve, understand this. If y'all don't understand this, science proves the Bible. Science talks about mitochondrial Eve. There's this one strand of RNA that's in our DNA that connects us all as humans. And so it's called, and it traces back to one black woman from uh, the middle part of Africa. They call her mitochondrial Eve. That's a scientific term. That means her mitochondria is in every, every single human being living. We all come from a black woman. Every single person. We don't all have a black father in common, but we all have a black woman in common. How about that? That's what science says. So science proves that. They call it, if you think I'm lying, you can Google it yourself. It's mitochondrial Eve. So I understand the importance and some of the hardship a black woman may have. And I can never perpetuate to understand, like, I can never perpetuate to understand everything, and I can never perpetuate to equate. So that's why people are like, oh, you want to be a woman? No, I don't. Y'all have it too tough, girl. Some of the stuff y'all do, bitch, I'd have been jump off the bridge. Some of the stuff black women have to do, girl, bitch, I'm not, I, I'm girl shaking it that strong. I could, bitch, I could cuss a bitch out, but girl, some of the stuff black women have to do, and what black women have to endure, sister, all I could do is tip my hat and watch in amazement. And some of the things that y'all have to endure. So trust and believe. You don't have no greater champion outside of black. What races was Adam and Eve? They had to be black because black is the only race that could create other races. Black can make white people. Black can make the other lesser skinned race. But you can't ever have a white person make a black pe person. It's never going to happen. Black people can make albinos, white people. Black people could have black people and they stay out the sun and eventually through generations and generations, genetically speaking, they'll, they'll lose the need for melanin. But, and so that you will have that. So black people, so Eve and Adam and Eve had to be black just for how we is on this planet. They could never be white. They, just scientifically speaking. And besides mitochondrial Eve was a black woman. So the woman that we all come from, the, the womb that all connects us as human beings on this planet is, is a black woman. So that's science proving the Bible. But if um, I was getting off. They just wanted me to talk some more. I'm just talking some more on some stuff that y'all need because they say we always talk about one thing, but we need to know what's the truth. So they have to be black because black is the only race that can create any other race. The other races can't create us. I'm just letting y'all know what's facts. That's genetically speaking, okay? Um, so with that being said, and this coming because I'm one eighth white, so I'm telling y'all. Yeah, so white people were created because black people went into the car. Some black people, the uh, this is true. The white people were created, 
on this planet. They're not native in that sense. But what happened was, this is just, I'm just being real what happened. They were the physically weaker. What happened back in the gap as, as, as humans at one time were nomadic, which means they, they roamed around a lot. And so they went in different places. So the the so so from Africa they went into Asia and how they lighten up is because those places were desert like Saudi Arabia and stuff they were very desert like they were our first offspring and so they started to cover themselves because it was so hot that's how they started lightening up so you get the brown people the um, Arabs and all those people they come they're the first ones that came from us real talk and so they lighten up like that but those people. They went further north to where kind of like Europe and stuff is a little bit. And they started, because they were the weaker of those. And so they went up into what's called the Caucasus Mountains. This is the, what they call Caucasia. Caucasians. This is why they call them Caucasians. The Caucasus Mountains sit on the border of where Europe and Asia is. And so they went up into those mountains. And because they were the weaker of, back in the gap, when we was doing stuff, you had to be strong. It was a survival of the fittest. And so if you were weak, you were basically cast out. You know how like they'll cast out the run or something like that? So these were the runts of those people. These were the, it talks about those, they, the Babylonians and stuff like that. I'm not telling y'all nothing wrong. I'm telling y'all exactly what happened. And so those people went up to the Caucasus Mountains. Those Caucasus Mountains people, they didn't have a need. They were the weaker. So they was in the mountains hiding from the stronger of us that was there. And so... They went up into the Caucasus Mountains. Go ahead, tell you. So they went to the Caucasus Mountains, but in the mountains they was hiding and trying to be whatever, whatever. But so they learned how to eat fish from the streams and stuff like that. But they didn't have a so they didn't have to fight for their food. They were very um, they were very um, they had fish and stuff that was found in the forest and shit like that, nuts and trees and shit. And so they cultivated their minds, but they need they they lost over centuries. Hundreds and hundreds of thousands of years, they lost the need of the melanin in their skin. As you know, um, people evolve based on need and stuff like that. The body evolves. Your body evolves based on need. When, you know what I'm saying? It does that. This is what happens. So after centuries of evolution, they um, they, they they didn't have a need for melanin because they were in the mountains. They was hiding in the mountains, and so that's why they get became white. The Asians came because as they went further west from Africa, uh, those people actually interbred with a certain monkey that had the slanted eyes. And that's how you get them. Um, so, but my point is, you have you have no greater champion, no greater champion for the black woman than MC Shady. Trust that. But with that championing, black women, I have to tell y'all the truth. Y'all complain a lot, and I hear y'all loud and clear about people being on a DL. Y'all complain a lot. A monkey, real life, yeah, it's a monkey that created the agents. The interbred. We used to do that too. Don't think, you, you know, we're closely aligned with monkeys. The monkey that created the Asians. It's, um, it's from Spider Monkey. Let me see. Not that monkey. Not monkey, ape. It's not the right thing. I'm telling you, it's not the right thing. Cause I know when I see it.
I'm gonna have to look it up in detail. But I, I, if, if, so it's okay. So listen, it, it's it's a if it's a thing on a science planet. You're gonna go check it out. It's why Europeans and Asia evolved so differently. But uh, it has something to do with the interbreeding of, of, of a particular ape. And I, I know it when I see it, but I cannot find it all of right now. But I'm, I'm not lying to y'all at all. So um, it talks about it in there. But um, wait, hold on. I hate when y'all don't think I'm lying to y'all about something that I know exactly about what I know what I read and I'm just having a little trouble <laughs> alright so it has something to do it's called an epicanthetic fold and that's why they have the slanted eyes um, and that's directly from the descendant of this particular monk ape. That's what it's called. The empathetic fold. That's why they have someone. All right, no, no, no. I want to tell y'all about this, y'all. No, listen, because they oh, fuck the Asians, girl. Unless y'all have an Asian old man, but they dick small, girl. So, um. What monkey are you? The black monkey. <laughs> All right. Shit, I want you to homeschool my kid. I can't. <laughs> I'm not a good homeschooler for mine. Okay. Master case. Thank you. I appreciate you. And I think that ain't not monkey. Um. <laughs> yeah, I'm the black monkey. <laughs> I'm the black monkey sister alright so black women y'all don't have no better champion than me I'm on your side I'm on your side trust the plus I'm on your side I know y'all the strongest thing on this planet I know it I know it but with that strength I have to also tell y'all the truth y'all come and complain about men on the DL but it's not their fault. It's yours. I'm not asking you to go and find you a dude on a DL, but I want. I'm asking you to be of complete and total acceptance of different people's sexualities. If you do that, your the 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 percentage of niggas on the DL gonna drop. The next generation of people, you, if you raise, if we start with yourself and raise our kids to be open-minded and accepting of different people and different sexualities, guess what's going to happen? The DL brothers ain't going to have to be DL. Understand that? Peep game. DL brothers is DL because he can't go to church. The black church won't accept him of who he is. He go to black church with his girlfriend, but let's see if it's he like boys. He can't go in there and hold his boyfriend hand. The black, the black, we gonna go explain how. If, if he can't go hang with his partners, you know why he can't go hang with his partners? Cause somebody gonna talk about, oh man, you're punk man, that punk playing basketball, playing playing football. He can't go play basketball, or football with his partners. You gonna instantaneously. Reject him or tell him it's just so nasty. You go instantaneously tell him, we don't you you know you know we cool with our gay friends. Don't get it twisted, but we but we also have such a and we also have such a appears to be animosity of people of different sexualities, and that's just not right. Somebody gonna talk to him. He can't go to family functions. We're gonna talk about him at the family. Girl, you know, girl, you know, girl, you know, Eddie May's son, girl, you know, he messed that boy. Yeah. That's what we gotta stop. Don't get it twisted. I think that's I didn't say it, I didn't say it was gonna completely absolve the problem. Niggas gonna lie, because they cheat on y'all too. Don't get it twisted. 
But at the same time, I'm just saying, 90% of the reason a man is on a DL is because he will not be accepted into the community from which he comes. That's why. So acceptance is one of the few things we learn early on as, social, as a socially adept society. We learn acceptance. We learn when we are accepted and we learn when we're not accepted. And we try and we tend to do things that are socially acceptable. Understand what I'm saying? Even as grown, what's socially acceptable? It's socially acceptable when you cough, you say, oh, excuse me. Or you sneeze, then somebody say, bless you. That's socially acceptable. That's not no rule. You wasn't born with that. That's what's considered social acceptableism. And so when we being socially acceptable, the tenets of sexuality, for some reason, in the black community are not socially acceptable. It's not being gay, bi, pan, trans, or whatever these other things, all the letters, all of them, LPT, um, excuse me, L, all of them, girl, just all of them, we got so many now. L, you know, it's not socially acceptable. And so when, so, so when it comes to that, my black sisters, the best thing you can do to combat the DL epidemic that obviously is still going around or strong is to be more socially acceptable of different ideals, not even to, not even yeah I said also and to instill that in our children. I heard listen. I have brothers. I have one brother. Okay, me and him are like early one. He's very opinionated. I'm very opinionated, and so. We, the kid may can raise a young boy to go into a straight man without any problems. I believe so. Just like straight people raise gay men. Why can't gay men raise straight men? I don't If you, if just because you're gay does not mean your children will be. I don't think gay is hereditary. so if you think that i'm sorry deal men need to accept themselves as well stop playing with us women i don't think they're playing with y'all i think it's just we have, because we're not socially acceptable we stop them from being their true selves i think that's in them i don't you i love my brother he's gay but i don't accept it why not Why don't you accept your brother being gay? And how do you accept me being gay? I have a brother. He is, so I have an oldest brother, and I told y'all about him before. But this brother is my second oldest brother. And, um, well, he's a twin, actually. Uh, but he act like he's the second oldest, but he's a twin. But I really think, technically, he's the third oldest. But he's a, he's a twin. And me and him are like early water. But he think he the oldest. <laughs> How are you? Hi, Hi. How you doing? Yeah, I'm 75 years old. Okay. Stop with the hey man. Guess what? It's a lot out here for you guys. Because guess what? I was a hustler at 12 years old. I'm 75, going to be 76 on the 26th. You are a nice looking young man. And guess what? I love my trait. Men and women. Cheering our best of friends. And I live in Atlanta. But Stop hating. Stop. Stop. Be, be, be happy for us that's trying to make it in this wicked world. Because guess what? If you don't have your coins, y'all going to be fucked up. They got a, a disease out here. No cure. It's no cure. Where I'm from, they, they experienced on this black man gave him a drug that he was going to heal for the corona. 
guess what? He died in two days. And God say, we're going to go out of here by what? Water or fire. Okay? Y'all better wake up and pay attention. And I love you. I love you. My daughter, I had a baby in New Orleans with a man I met when the police pulled him over because he was driving a Fleetwood Cadillac. We're talking about in the 80s, 81, okay? 80, yeah, 80. Okay? And he didn't even know me. And I come to Louisiana on to a Bunner Brothers show and back in the 80s. He told me his car keys, okay? He didn't know who I was. When I opened up his government apartment, you know how black people is going to be nosy. I opened up his, his government apartment, guess what I seen in there? If he didn't have four or five hundred thousand dollars, I ain't sitting here. You can stop the piss out of me. And all that uh, heroin and the little brown bottles. I could have ripped him off. I took his car to his parents' house. And guess what? He got back in touch with me when he bonded out on some tragedy shit. Because they told him they got women from Atlanta coming for the Bunner Brothers show. So he was supposed to be a pimp and got caught up in some bullshit for the Bunner Brothers show, okay? But I'm just, I just want to tell you this here. Y'all, we got to stop. And, and, and Shaky, you're a beast. You don't even know you're a beast. And God, I'm telling you, God going to use you to save a lot of people's lives. He going to use you, baby. I'm 70, and I wish I could go back to where you at. You heard me? <laughs> Which I was a beast also, a gangster, okay? And I got my ass. Okay. Boy, they wise were knocking on my fucking doors. I want my husband out, Joe. You know what I'm saying? Bitch, he ain't in here. Guess what? He been jumped down the back in there, okay? His Cadillac or his Rose or his Bentley will be parked in the front of my condo, okay, that he paid for. But, Shake, I just want to tell you this here. Stop the bullshit. Because well, it's it all about us. And then we study killing. They say Louisiana is so bad with the killing. I don't know because I don't like the news. But if Trump is in the hospital, I hope he go I ask the, the good Lord to forgive me for saying he need to pass away. Because he hurt us. And I'm going to tell you another thing. Them Chinese people been had them masks on. Five years ago, we didn't pay attention. We didn't we we, we didn't pay attention and we wasn't school. That's why we go in the nail salons, you know, the people be covered up. Them people knew already. You know what I'm saying? Shake it. I love you. Keep doing what you're doing, but stop. I don't I don't like the hate. Okay. And I love you. Uh, you come back to Atlanta, I'm going to DM you my, um, my phone number, and we're going to hook up. I want to take you out to brunch or whatever you want to do. It's on me. I don't give a goddamn if it costs five or ten thousand dollars. It's on me, okay? Okay. Well, we're gonna get us, well, if that's the case, we're going to get us some buck naked trick. <laughs> no, I want to take you. I want to take you on a cruise. to the I'm thinking about if we can book something. And we don't need no no more than a hundred. I think it's like a hundred and fifty on a cruise, and they're gonna pay for it. But you catch the back end; it's gonna come all to you. I don't want nothing. You hear me? And to, for black folks to say what we got to say, you hear me? Because it's it's this it's a time of defeat. Our opinion. We can't hate on each other, and the white folks love it. They love, they love it, baby. They love, they love hate, okay? They had us, which I, I thank the good Lord. My my grandmother, she had built a school, a church. We didn't have to pick cotton. My mom never had to pick cotton. She had her own two cars. She had an old mule, you know what I'm saying? And an old mule would make money for her, you know? But was we didn't the, have to go out there. And it's a time for enough sake. Was the, shit was, is real. Was the mule, they was got the mule. shit they can't, they can't kill. And ain't nothing but walking pneumonia. You take that lemon hug and boil it. 
with a little vinegar, you're going to kill your own body, but you got to drink it hot, hot, hot. <laughs> Girl, yeah. got some shit. And I got a girlfriend just called me a week and a half ago. She didn't bury her son from the COVID. And then she said she had in January. They told her, and go home, gave her some for a cold. I had another girlfriend had been ICU for 35 days where her eyeballs had popped out. You it's it's, it's funny you mentioned, daughter, it's funny you mentioned, see that, okay? See that, it's funny you mentioned, see that, it's funny you mentioned you. My people, my, listen, see that, I, I, I know, it's funny you and mentioned. pay attention. Do you see, do you see Cherry Bum Bum? That's my best friend. Do you see her on here acting? Uh, no. And Jaguar, we don't pay her no attention, okay? Okay? Because this shit y'all be on is reality shit. But you come so strong on them sons of bitches, they get lost, okay? I ain't comb my hair yet. I look at hot mess. I don't want you to see my picture, but I'm going to send you my picture. I'm a beast, okay? So, and so, I love you, you I love you, too. Hospital, I'm not no hospital no matter. You got that band on your arm for it. Oh, that's a that's a that's an eye watch. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. But I'm 75 years old. Take it. Keep, keep doing what you're I have, doing. So, Stay what's your? I have a, I, before you. Okay. Guess what? Guess what God say? Love our what? What God love, say? Come love on, our, keep love it real. Our, what do you say? Love our what? Neighbor. Huh? Yeah. What do you say? Love our neighbor. And and our neighbors can be our enemies. And I know you ain't want me to come on here because I'm telling you like a a, a real 75-year-old hustler. I hustle. Guess what? I didn't even finish the eighth grade. But guess what? When I did go in there for to do my, my license, to get my license for, for cosmetology, I ain't missed one. Okay? Okay. And I know how God moves in a serious way and I know what mysterious ways is, but y'all might don't know. He comes, he <laughs> comes, thinking he's real. I'm chosen. And I know what? You're going to be chosen. Right. And I'm a prophet. I'll say, what I tell you, take it to the bank, okay? When I DM you, whatever I see, I'm going I'm to send it to you, take it to the bank. And you're going to say, where that old lady come from? Okay? Right. But I just want to throw some purse at you. Leave that mess alone. Leave that bullshit. Leave that bullshit alone. You got a career, man. You got. You just bought you a house. Guess what? Playing in same lane, that bitch can disappear tomorrow. Okay. Right. I'm keeping it real with you, man. You doing? You doing? You look at Buck. I, I I look at his. I look at him too. And guess what? I give him his prop. But guess what? That man struggles. With that other woman who's doing time, I don't know her name, and I don't want to know her name, but I be praying for her. Bro. And he did, and he did grab the little baby, and doing his shit for that little girl. You hear me? Right. And look at him. He 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 doing his shit. And so you can do your shit. Get off that Instagram shit and handle your business. You is a beep out here. Your name is fucking recognized. You got respect out here. I met you. I'm gonna tell you where I met you at. I flew in. You was on Nicholson Highway at this new little mall. You was out there, you know, for most. You all remember that? And you asked me, where are you from? And I told you from I'm from Atlanta. And I told you I was so glad to meet you, but I got something to tell you down the road. You all remember that? He was on Nicholson Drive. Nicholson, is it Nicholson? Nicholson, like by LSU? Like yeah. when you come into LSU, you was in that little mall on your left-hand side. It was last year. You don't remember that? Huh? Nicholson. Nicholson. And they were selling plates and stuff. It was a black lady selling plates out there. And you was, uh, uh, you was out there. Uh, you was the DJ. You I was the that? MC. Yes, I do remember that. It was the pop-up show. Okay, you remember that? I do. You don't remember the conversation we had? I don't remember the conversation. I don't remember. Yeah, I know I was... you have so many people on you, but I'm all I want to say, I'm going to hang up 
and I'm Mama Peach. I don't know what I don't know what these kids got me under because they got me with like eight pages in which I don't understand it, and I don't I don't want to understand. It, but I'm gonna tell you this: God got you. Be patient, please. Be patient, cause guess what? It's gonna all come to you. All that hating ass shit. Some these people love that. Cause guess what? Before you talk about it, they hating on. It. Cause guess what? You have your. We have our chances to get what these people they got. You okay? This girl started off with t-shirts. Okay. And I think I, they told me you doing bindings. It's like, I'm going to get about 20 or 30 from you. And then I want you, I'm going to pay for them. And I want you to donate them to people. You heard me? I don't need them because you say I ain't got that much hair. But anyway, shake it. Let's keep it real, baby. You heard me? Okay. Shake it. Enough is enough. Well, you're going to miss your blessing. Because they love to hear that hating ass shit. I bet you say some shit positive. Guess what? Watch how your 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 uh, Instagram score gonna go down. Okay. Okay. They don't want to hear the good shit. They want to hear the bad shit. You you slamming this motherfucker. You knowing this motherfucker business. Come on, cause guess what? When you when 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 God touch you to get your grind, I promise you, those people that you was dogging, I promise you, they gonna look out for you. I promise you this. And you're going to say, I don't know where that old lady come from, okay? <laughs> Please listen to me. Fuck the bullshit. Fuck what they saying. You hear me? They don't want to hear good shit. They don't, I don't see none of them on, on your Instagram saying, shake it, you wrong. You know what I'm saying? Because I know you play that black party shit too. You hear me? But shake it. <laughs> do what you do best. You do your music. You're a damn good DJ. You had me out there dance. I was dancing by myself. And then here come a man pull up. I don't know if you remember. And then when you go in on, on the Nixon Drive Highway, where we was, you go straight and go straight where they were serving the food at. Setting, I think, for like $15 or $12. But I used to tip them like $200. Probably paid for your, you know, for you to come out and, you know, do what you had to do for him. Because he mm -hmm. said, give, and it's going to give back to you triple. You heard me? Mm -hmm. Even the people in Atlanta, when they be out there, especially the kids, that's what fucked me up. When they be out there trying to sell water instead of trying to sell drugs, okay? I give them two or three hundred dollars. You know what I'm saying? Okay, to go help your mama pay her light bill because y'all might be in the dark the next day, okay? <laughs> and that's how you're supposed to do it. An old, an old, an old, old white man taught me this. And he was like 80-something years old and I was 30. He told the lady, I was behind him, whatever she get, take care of, take, take, take this extra money and give it to her and her two kids, and the rest go to the waitress. You heard me? Because guess what? He sold his seed. We don't sow seed. If we sow seed, I promise you. And when you start doing it, watch how things change for you, okay? I love you, Shaky. I love, I love you, too. I love, I love you, too, baby. I love you, too. So Thank you, you see who I am. Okay, yeah. I'm just telling you some real shit that God showed me. God, please forgive me. You going somewhere, baby? You going somewhere? All He wants you to do is be patient. Okay. All right, my love. Thank okay? you so much. Thank just you. do that for me, please. Yeah. Okay. Fuck the bullshit. Okay. And and try to talk to them young kids to let them young kids know this what you want out here. Cause guess what? You a leader to them. They're going to respect you, okay? Even wish him off, okay? They're going to use him. You know what I mean? They're going to mess over him. Because he don't got no, you know, because he can't think fast. Shekana and Mooney, they're going to get him. You're going to say that the old lady told me. He can't fix his hair or fix his makeup. He has to go somewhere else. Mooney made his part, Okay? With the with the uh what that was he the, his uh CD, 
-hmm. And then the shit wasn't even right, and you know it. Answer the phone. You ain't answering the phone. The nigga was supposed to answer the phone and then clicked on him. Pay attention, okay? okay. He needed somebody out there for you that was going to help him. They're going to they gonna take advantage of him. Man, I could tell you some shit. Huh. Pay attention. Did Shekinah go to um, Trouble Man's birthday party? Hell no. He hates her here. He hates the ground. She messed over his wife. That house she living in, no who paid for it? Tiny. Who paid for the law? Tiny. No. And then when Trouble Man got in and know what was going on, he made her cut loose from her. You got a that, choice. Go with her or stay with your husband. Okay, so, so and that's all not, that old fake ass. Okay, okay listen, girl, stop. Right. It's all right, so listen, And I listen. love you, Shaky. No, I love you too, but I need you, you to know. understand. I need I'm you to understand. I'm praying for you. And so do listen. your shit. Because guess what? You're going to blow up so fast. You're going to say, that lady yeah. told me that 75 year old lady told me. Right, but okay. listen. You, you, and do you, your face. You need to do a face, man, because your skin is beautiful. I have a face. So what you use, you might use piss <laughs> on it or whatever. Your skin is beautiful. Your teeth is beautiful. If you make a lunch for some toothpaste or your face line, do that for me, okay? I have a, I have a face line. It's called Soup Cosmetics. You know, okay. No, I no, I know. No. And then your hair. I, I did hair for 30, 38 years. And I say, I just saw a bitch get red hair. Then the next day it's green. And then two days later, and she a look at mine. I can try to go in there and do the same thing because mine is beige, beige, beige. And I hadn't did it in about four weeks because I had major neck surgery. Okay, so listen, this is what I need to do for, for, for you. I need to listen to me right quick, Grandma. I'm listening. So, Tiny did not pay for Shekinah's house. Yes, have... she did. Oh, That's sweetheart. Why? Listen, I, I witnessed, I saw, I've been to Shekinah's house. I did it in her day. And I'm not only that, her first, listen, did. her first, she got checks from three reality shows. One of the shows, she's not only an executive producer, she was the the, the creative director, and they Shake bought the it. show. Listen, I no, I'm telling you, the I money is definitely, the, 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 the money, party. You, oh, whatever, party you, you know what? whatever party you're talking about, and the party you're talking about, and his birthday, you birthday listen, listen to me, Mama, I need you to listen to me. Listen to me, right? No, listen, listen, it don't even matter you that, listen, now, sister, you're not going to over-talk me, especially with something I know to be true myself. I've seen it with my own eyes. The 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 money from the the weave trip show, they bought that show outright from her. It's, it's, it's still available on BT Plus, but they paid up. So who bought it? The, the, the Viacom, mom. That was a big it? Viacom bought come on, come on. weave trip. Don't be no fool, man. No, man, you not, they, no neither do you. It don't make no sense. Red, uh, I mean a little pink. It don't uh, make listen, so R it don't make no sense. Why listen to what I'm telling you. Listen to what I'm telling you. Why what what sense does it make for me to be in it doesn't make sense for you to say something that's not true? The woman it got paid for the reality. I tell you because you don't you know reality shit. That's why trouble man don't mess with her, period. But he I mean, actually he does. I've actually met I met him through her. What did you talk about? No, what are you talking about? No, I'm asking. I can what call are you him right now. I don't know how to do the three way on here, and I can call him right now. He can't stand her, you know. Uh, but, but I'm that, glad I, I, him and, and I think and I think. But listen, together, whatever differences they may have had, they're cordial now, oh, and she's and, 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 and also to, and, and also you too. Know that's how no, to be. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not no. I'm not no. Get older, y'all. Gonna get what? And so, as far as as far as tiny enough, as far as, far as tiny should kind of be friends, that's still happening. But I, I'm I'm telling you what I know, mom. This is not yeah, something I'm telling you. I've, I've been I, I just come from. I, the, live, I live in Atlanta. No, I just you, you just and I just met her and I had a meeting with these. Listen, hold up. I just had a meeting with these people. That's tiny, that's tiny Chicago. I just had a meeting with them over a show that we have. The people is doing good. In fact, Chicago tiny is a big investor in it. What did you talk about? And that's I, not. And I guess what I already know about it. And guess what. And you don't even know it yet. You've been picked. Okay? I'm not, I'm, it's not for me to be picked. You're I'm part of the, the show. You I'm part of the production of it. That's not something I'm, that's not something I'm, I'm a pick on the show. It's a mean for me to be, it's a mean to be, it's not a mean, hold on, hold on. It's not a mean for me to be on somebody's seat. Hold on. That's a, the, the, the audition, 
That what I'm talking about, that's not the listen, hold up, listen, mom, because you're tripping. I'm telling you what I know for fact. That's not true what you're saying. I'm just telling you what it is. The woman had the money to buy her own house. She made it from not only the, but I'm telling you, a show that only that's just the creative director. The show, the meeting I had with them has nothing to do with okay, the show. I know this, you this show is not what I'm going to be on. This is what I'm sitting behind it, the scenes for. Shake it. You remember when she told Shekana, I mean, Shekana told, uh, told uh, that girl that I don't like this house. I want a bigger house like you. And uh, uh, Major Girl uh, came and told her, no, you need to take this house. And then they was building from the ground, okay? And shake your pay attention. Her own mama don't mess with her. Pay attention. Sister, because she was more... mama don't mess with her. Because she was raised by her grandmother, babe. Man, come on. I don't give a damn. Her own uncles, them don't mess with her. Yeah, they the do. That's they not true either. There, That's not true. The only reason why, because y'all don't know... The only reason why the uncle was there to pay attention to that old lady's check, okay? And guess what? I bet that so, so, no so the uncle that's the, the uncle that still stay well, he there for who check? He don't even stay there no more, shake. Yes, he do. I just he left him in my house last. I just left him in my house less than two it's, weeks ago. You're lying. You're wrong. Be, shake it. Listen to me. It's two cousins that be there, okay? I live oh, sister, I have met the uncle. Every time I went to the house, okay, I've met the him there. Tall, I've been to this woman's house a few times. Tall, the bright tower looks like he kind of slow. Looks like he what? I met two of them, actually. The bright tower kind of looked like he kind of slow. That's who he was under his mama. But she kind of missed over her mama. Man, you don't never talk about. And then when they when she on Instagram, people be asking her, "Why you don't talk about your mom?" And you guess what she do? Blah. Okay, Shakana, you know what you have done. You messed up family. Even with the uh, what you call the repath, y'all call it in Louisiana. But they call it a sit down dinner or whatever here. But in it with the repath, I want you to go back and look at the repast tape. Go back and look at the repast tape. When the mama walked in and walked right back out. So I listen, didn't speak to her mama. Again. I don't know. I listen, you, you. listen. But no, you loved it. my mama so much. My mama brought me to the world, but you can't love me that my mama brought me to have you. Come on, shake it. Come on, shake it. Listen. Shake it, I love you. I listen, love you too. Shaking, but you got to realize something. you can't you can't shake talk it. about stuff that's inaccurate. Something. Shake, I'm going to DM you something and just, if you don't want to see you at this, I see you. So when you come back to LA, I mean Atlanta. In a couple weeks. You're flying out for LA tomorrow, huh? In a couple weeks. You going to be at the same spot? Um, I'm going to be all over. <laughs> Man, I wish you could have got, got your wings under that little boy. They're going to mess over him, Shake it. Who? Shamar. They're going to mess not over finna mess o They're not going to mess over Shamar. They do more for Shamar than anything. I've seen. Yeah. And then they talking about calling the social security people on him. Man, come on, man. Let that Who was going to do that? Nobody said that. Who did they say that? Where you been? Yeah, they have been saying it. Did they, did she kind of just not pay for his whole video release? My mama's so mad, shaky. She don't want to lose the check. He tell you he give his mama his whole check. But but this should, but so okay that's cool but where was well I'm not you know listen sister okay I appreciate I'm you gonna coming. I'm call you personally. I'm gonna yeah, say please you call me personally because yeah, what you're saying you saying right now this is not appropriate. Guess it's what? not. That's all Handle unfounded. Handle your stuff. I ain't gonna lie. You be on <laughs> shake it. You a beast and you don't even know it. I know what God telling me to tell you. Keep your head up high and watch on your left to right and the back of your enemies. Some of the bitches don't want to be, you know what I'm saying, Shaky? Yes, Some people don't understand. give a fuck about you. I'm talking to Shaky. Yeah, and my daughter just walked in. She can tell you some shit. Okay? I can't wait till I come to Louisiana, which I come there for Mardi Gras. And Shaky, we're going to have a ball, okay? I love you, Shaky. I love you too, man. And I pray for you every morning, Thank you. every night, to keep a shield around you. And for you to open up your eyes to be the best. Because guess what? If you just 
do what I tell you and be patient. Shake it, that money going to come. Them bad, some sex. So I said, that old lady told me. That old lady told me. You heard me shake it. And guess what? You going to get it. I, look, look, we got all these here. But anyway, I don't want them to follow me. Keep following and shake it. Keep following shake it. Keep following shake it. That's my hey, daughter. She how you doing? Say, hey. I can't wait to I can't wait to come back to her. How you know you messy when you start mess from Louisiana to Africa. <laughs> I try. Sir, he's kind of cute though. Who? Sir, I wish I w I wish I would know because I give him a place. Yeah, yeah. Tell my me and you old and messy. No, old and messy. <laughs> I, I'm old and messy. Cause I I pray I pray for him. Cause I know he's gonna. Say, okay, come. What? With the things I know. Oh, but shake it. I love yeah. you so much. I, I don't wanna you. shake it. Damn me, your number. So we, okay. I got some good sit flat for you, and I'm gonna help you. I'm gonna help you. I can help you. Okay. Right. Please. Now right. give him my give him my DM. DM. She gonna she gonna DM you my number, and I'm gonna help you. I don't, right. even want, I don't even want five percent. You heard me? Okay. Money talks and what? Bullshit box. Thank you so much. Right. And okay. guess what? And guess what? I got it. And I'm <laughs> gonna help you. Fuck them bunnies. I want you to go further with your skin. Your skin and your teeth. Wow. And that's Thank what they're so. looking at. They doing this the eyelashes that shit. I didn't even, you know what I'm saying? But all right, okay, because she got she in my car and she needs, but shake it. She going to, you can do it from here? Yeah. No, we're going to do it on the other way. Okay, he go, she going to do it on the other way because I'm 75 years old. I'm going to show my face. Mm, I love you, shake it. I love you, Susie. I love you, Susie. You got to answer for me because they told okay. me I got 10 pages. What this one say? What this page say? Like, <laughs> What this page say, Shaggy? <laughs> With Big L? What that page say so he can know who I am? Talk to him. Please get on. <laughs> All right, we love you too, man. Y'all have a nice day. I couldn't. <laughs> I, I couldn't hang up because this, I'm not for the. I'm not for the. Look, I, I like. I like kids, but I also like our older. Our older elder grandparents. We they deserve our respect too, girl. So I'm. A, I'm not. You know. I'm already running around the city because I'm thinking about Dick twenty nine seven. But, but, but. So I wasn't gonna hang up on. I wasn't gonna hang up on. Y'all could hang up on. I wasn't gonna hang up on. I'm not for to do that. I'm that's that's disrespect. Bitch, I'm already around here suck you think about dicks 29 stuff. So bitch, I gotta I'm not finna just do more. <laughs> so I wasn't gonna hang up on her. I wasn't gonna hang up on her and I was gonna talk to her respectfully. So I wasn't hanging up. Now if y'all hung up, that's all y'all. I wasn't gonna do it. I'm gonna wait till I'm gonna let her speak up peace. Because I know if somebody would have hung up on my grandma, I'm gonna pop your mother. Don't you hang up on you better let us talk. I don't know what she's finna talk about. Just like you know how every church girl, it used to be Sister Agnes in our church girl, she'd get up and sing for like four hours, girl. B selection going from one song to another. She mixed up three songs, girl. You really getting um, floodgates and uh, rain and melody all in the same song, girl, for four hours. And you couldn't, nobody couldn't tell her nothing. It just, I just couldn't tell her nothing, girl. I, ra I was raised right. I was raised right. I'm not going to be like, girl, you know what? You ain't talking about nothing. Hang up. No, I'm not doing it. Girl, speak your piece. Go ahead, I got to sit here and listen, girl. And just like you had to mind them stories, girl, when it was on. It's the same thing. So I let her speak up, peace, girl. And we go from there. And <laughs> so I, I don't know what she was talking about. Let me ask Sleep. What was it? Sleep pretty much. You want to come live? Oh, no, that's poop. I didn't even know you could go live. <laughs> don't hang up on that old lady. Don't do that. Don't do that. What's going on? Take it.
Yeah. You know, I never ever. <laughs> <laughs> Grandma said, "F them bonnets." <laughs> She said, she said, fuck them bodies. Baby, fuck them. That's what she said. Grandma gonna stop him. Yeah. I don't know why. We tolerated her. It was fun. <laughs> I don't know why I'm... she... I don't know what she had against the bodies, girl. I like the bodies, girl. girl. I, I like them. Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna stay, but you know, I just had to let Grandma know. Grandma, don't play with the bodies. Don't, don't play with the bodies. Don't play with the bodies. All right, she. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Girl, I don't know. <laughs> I like my I like my bonnets, girl. I wear my bonnets, girl. <laughs> What's going? Somebody said somebody said who said the Judy? <laughs> <laughs> I know this old shiver old smelly pussy thing didn't come on here. First, she was preaching the amazing grace, how sweet the sound. How sweet you should be. Then she, from, then she went. I don't care. Then she went from. Yeah, because she know everybody key. But if you don't get your old shiffle roll pussy smelling ass in the closet. Girl, and stay there. Girl, yeah, I'm love, girl. Oh my God. She killed me with that. I was like, can we get to the teeth? She don't want you to be messy. Girl, you know you work for Judy. That, that sounded like the bread ain't cheap. I don't care. I'm here she, for it today. She I just, just wrote it. She was like, yeah, don't be messy. But listen, I got some mess for you. Let me tell you about these people. Girl, you know that she bought her house. I'm like, wait, sister, did you just not tell me to not be messy? <laughs> but yeah, she's still. She on here. I just can't. I said, people just let the <laughs> cedar wood smelling old gizzard turkey neck, long tarantula. Then she keep it sister. She wants you and this and that. Bitch, shake it. Don't eat no old pussy. <laughs> I came with that. Like, how you going to be nice and you trying to make him nice to people, bitch, but you filing all the pages with several burn pages. <laughs> She said How she we know it wasn't one of the people you kicked out and she came back? Uh -uh. This old motherfucking thing. She drove me. I wanted the Warner brother, Bo brother, Tarana brother. Just go through the phone. Key that. Give me your phone. Give me your phone. She smelled like she was a glory of Vanderbilt. Through the phone. Through the phone. It's too much shaking. You sitting up there. I, I respect you for that because I couldn't do it. I would have been like, Jesus, strike the button, please. Help me. She's trying to tell you to be nice because you're going to miss your blessing. How you going to come on here and stop? Girl, you throw so much shade. <laughs> Got that old Wolverine pissy pussy on here, long out of stress pussy on here talking my bitch. I'm going to need you. And, and turn it. She ain't got no web. She got a web, bitch. Pod web. She on here trying to get hair from shaking. Bitch, shaking on you no old pussy. You don't eat an old pot of stale mustard greens, bitch. Let them know shaking. You got to let them know. Then she on here talking about Shekana. She don't even know this girl. She don't even follow her. And she would have followed Shekana, really. She'll know what's going on. That girl got her own money. She branded herself. <laughs> This girl came on here dropping all that bad low. Good thing dropping I'm bad sick of her. I said, wait. I'm she sick of her. Stop me. being busy, but let me tell you about this girl. You know she, but they try to mess over Shimon. I'm like, wait, what? I'm sick of her. <laughs> they say, add her again. What's she on here saying? <laughs> what pussy on here? No, baby. Go take your ride with your daughter, bitch. Uh uh. Because I ain't the nice person. I ain't nice. Shake nice. Mm -mm. No, ma'am. Not right now. Go sit home and listen to your thing and drink your gin, Momo. <laughs> Not today. Girl. Oh. She was, I mean, she was trying, I'm going to take you on a cruise. She <laughs> wants you on a cruise. She wanted you to ride that big pink convertible between her legs, baby. Uh-uh. Shady, now, Shady, if you go to Atlanta and you fucking this on this old lady, you know one thing. With the sippers is going to eat you up. I'm not going to this old lady like that. <laughs> 
Don't add her shaky. Uh uh. No, ma'am, come back tomorrow. Elderly hours, 10%. Not today. Go eat somewhere. Go cook some butter beans or something. Go do some. Read the newspaper. Clip coupons. Go do something. But coming on here, he's telling you going to pray for me. And then you're going to turn to Satan. I know them devils go to church. I know it. She a devil in disguise, Shaky. Don't send her your number because she's going to tear your phone up. And she might sell it. I don't I'm trust a, her. A, Who sent her, the brat? I'm happy to. Handsome she got them drips for sale. <laughs> Shit. Uh uh. She up next. And then how she was talking, she might be oil and burning. Shake it, don't stick your dick in that. I'm not going around the block I'm a couple of times. I'm not going to do that to no one. I know you can shake it. Tell me, did you get hard? No. No, I did. Did it thump? No. Oh, she ain't gave you them kind of vibes? No, she gave you the mother of the church vibes, huh? When yeah, the 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 big hat. Yeah, I can't. Do it. I can't. She better go sit down walking by with them the pins hanging from under her pants, smelling like cedar wood. I can't. <laughs> nope, not today. I'm off of vacation. That was over on Saturday. Uh huh. I'm back. Yeah, I can't. I just can't. Who sent her? Home help was at the door. They didn't took girl. I can't. <laughs> it was going good. She was, you know, when it was, I ain't seen the good part yet. When she came on here, was like, I love you. Now that was good. That's it. Then she went to, you gotta stop talking about people. You're missing your blessings. Well, what the fuck she just did? She didn't miss us in three circles. <laughs> Go away. Yeah, tell her again. Go away. Go to the nursing home. They got an opening on the, the third floor. <laughs> I can't girl, send her over here by me. I'll help out. Girl, we not for the sale by you, girl. That no turkey way. was wearing off on her. She, she better leave that future alone. Quit listening to it. <laughs> girl, we not for the sale. <laughs> she went like old yeah. cedar wood. I bet you she looked like, and I want to take you on a cruise. Huh, and a whole bunch of old people digging on you like a pot of cotter green. Bitch. <laughs> uh uh. Nope. Mm -mm. Uh uh. Nope. Shaking, you blushing and everything. I just can't. I, I think that thing was thumping. The nerve on the back of that thing was bouncing up and down. That did hold on. Let us see. I was. I promise you, I was. It's hard, shaky. No. No. <laughs> they say it's three pool, baby. We gonna call you back. All right, let me go. Let me go back to work. <laughs> let me go. All right, let me let y'all know Jesus love y'all. This I know before the Bible tell me so. Uh huh. Don't add Dorothy back. Let her go. Let no, her I'm go actually, find her yeah, Sunday I'm, best dress. Yeah, I'm, I'm about to go. <laughs> let me let you go finish blushing and rubbing yourself while that old lady talks. <laughs> I'll show you I was wrong. Eating her butterscotch. <laughs> let me go. Girl. Uh -oh. All right, so let me get the post. I got some stuff to post. Uh, it'll be posted. Uh, I love you. I'll be back.